Hello and welcome to today's cryptocurrency technical analysis where together we're going to be diving straight into the Bitcoin chart here and I'm going to be going over the absolute must know levels right now. These are extremely important and very, very well respected. This is an absolute trader's dream market right now. Why? Because the technical analysis is just on point respect. It's absolutely beautiful. And I'm going to be explaining that to you in this video. So pay full attention and you will be taking some very useful insights away from this. And of course, I'm going to be picking up right where I left off yesterday's video, where I was explaining the short position I, would, I was in for around 2.5 million dollars and the levels and targets I had for the downside on that. The first being the value area low, which during the rest of that day, we come down and tapped that value area low to pretty much the dollar for a 2% rise in price before putting in a lower high and in fact, in the end, losing the value area lower support. Okay, level to level trading, once losing that value area lower support, we look down towards our next level, which I also gave you in yesterday's video, which was at $15,866 being the zone of that daily level of support. So obviously that uh, in the end played out very well, that short taking it down to this daily. And in the end, we start to find support at this zone. Okay. So this is our daily level that we had marked out from yesterday's video. As you can see, price in the end hits the value area low, gets a bit of a bounce, puts in a lower high, continues down to the daily level of support here. And this is where we start to find our level of support. And in the end, we start to get the bounce underway, okay? So this bounce really starts to get underway. And this is kind of a funny post. <laughs> and this is what we call hashtag CC pools and their regards. Uh, because after hitting that daily, we started to get the bounce underway, right? And I posted to my team, I'm looking at the highs of $17,000 for the upper target at the moment, okay? So I'm basically telling my team, looking for higher still at the moment, and the high just above $17,000 for me is the target at the moment for the upside. And we're talking about two minutes later, two minutes later, uh, we started to get the amazing push and we literally come up to up to the high of 17,000 high, swing failure pattern these highs and get a bit of a drop underway. But it was just crazy the way that I posted, um, looking for another push to the upside, looking for just above $17,000. And I'm literally not even joking, two minutes later, the Bitcoin market pumped to the upside to take into that target. Uh, it's like someone saying here, long after Daniel's comment, price moves up 2% instantly. Uh, we're getting Elon Musk levels of influence in the market. Uh, <laughs> this is no joke. Happened last week as well, within two minutes. It's kind of like really crazy. I'm doing these posts and then within like a few minutes, the market is moving exactly as I am predicting. It's uh, pretty nice right now. And that's what I mean. It's an absolute trader's dream. But upon uh, hitting that target, and that's what I call a perfect swing failure pattern of the $17,000 high, uh, we're obviously then looking for the, the VWAP. And I'd just like to show you exactly what went on here. Okay. So from the swing failure pattern, which I'll just simply mark out for you here. Okay. That's the swing failure pattern. When we zoom in here, it looks very obvious, right? pump, take out the $17,000 high. And then when we could look at here on a lower term time frame, I'll add on the VWAP for you, just so you can see what went on. Okay, we come up, take out that high, pull back to the VWAP. And this is our, our, our large volatile moves, by the way, from the swing failure pattern to the VWAP, that is a drop of 4.3%. And then from the VWAP to this rise is another 2.6%. A uh, two point eight six percent, sorry, and have a guess what rejected this? Well, Fibonacci from high down to the low. Put that on the CC template, and you can see it came right into the CC for another pullback. Okay, so this is just absolutely crazy, right? So swing failure pattern, VWAP, almost four percent. Let's just say four percent rise from VWAP to CC, a two point eight percent rise, and then from the CC back down to the VWAP, that's another two point you know, 5% drop. Okay. This is just amazingly well-respected technical analysis. And that's just over the past 24 hours of price action, able to recognize the levels, take and execute the trades, see the reactions, trade shorts, trade longs, e.g. trade the highest probabilities. 
And then it's not only the highest probabilities, but it's seen the respect of the levels absolutely perfectly. And it is just truly amazing for us day traders. It's just a absolutely wonderful market to be in right now. And I'm very, very, very much taking full advantage of this situation. Okay, the trades are just absolutely wonderful. And so I've now explained the last 24 hours of price action here, how we have seen some of these levels seen their reactions, taken some trades, and that brings us up to right where we are now, where I'd like to uh, basically explain the next levels that I'm looking for over the next 24 hours to come. Okay, 24 hours pushing on 48, the next few days maximum, okay? And what we've got going on here locally, okay, is, well, first of all, we can do our simple CC pool, right? We can just do our simple CC pool. I'm actually going to be looking around this, okay? Um, you can see we have, you know, first of all, around 16,300 to 15,930. Okay. So that would be our Fibonacci levels locally. But I do think we have like bigger levels than, than, than that here. Okay. This daily is now tapped, so I can remove that. We obviously have our bigger daily down here at 13, 15,300. <laughs> 15,300. Uh, really massive level for me, by the way. Really massive level there. And this is a zone, of course. This is a zone. But so this zone that we have down here, really from around 15.2 to 15.400, really massive um, level of support down here. And to, to the upside, I think it's it's also very clear indeed. Obviously now we have swing failure pattern this high, so we can also remove this temporarily. And we can see above us here around the NPOC, which is 17,275. This is again a zone for me, and it really comes in between 17,300 and 50 to around you know 17200 this npoc zone for me uh, is our level to the upside so here we can see when we just look at this really simply we have an important level of support down here and an important level of resistance here it's like i always will say level to level trading let's say for example we just break through this level of resistance well that's fair enough. <laughs> you know, that can happen. And then we would look towards our next level to the upside, which then you can see is around 17,600. And it's the same It's the same scenario again. Level to level trading, mark out our levels, do the technical analysis, take the trades based off the reaction. E.g. a reaction could be something as simple as this, right? Come down, hit the level, you know, form some wicks onto the level. Then you can say, hey, the reaction is bullish. The level is holding. I can take this trade and place a stop loss, for example. Okay. Otherwise, you simply would have, let's just say this happened, for example, and we mark out this and price instead of coming down and forming some wicks and a bit of a reaction just does this boom straight through the level. Then there's no reaction, thus no trade. And we would have looked down for our next level to the downside, right? So this is how I approach the market. This is how myself you know, I'm, I'm making millions of millions of dollars trading this market. It's a level to level environment. And that is what we teach, right? This is the theory that we teach. This is how we go about our trades every single day. And, you know, right now it's, it's, I'm just very much going to repeat. I love the technical analysis. The levels are really well respected and there's nothing more that I could really want to take away in this market right now. And while on the subject of emotions, obviously right now the market is in full fear, very scared. And in my opinion, this just plays into the greater market maker model of, you know, get this really big move while everybody's removing all their funds. People are going to basically be in full shock and miss the move when it comes. Uh, this is something that I'm going to be expanding upon, but this is, you know, this is the move I am ready and waking for. The big market maker move and, you know, the majority of people are just going to simply miss it. Uh, so this is something I'm very much looking forward to seeing and trading. And um, I will just end with a reminder, if you want to get the education from myself and the rest of the coaches at Chart Champions, you can, of course, do that over at chartchampions.com. We got all the education you're ever going to need. Of course, this is where you can come in and get the live trading updates from myself. We got a live trading stream tomorrow as well. You know, you can get in on these new Elon Musk influence levels. And, uh, you know, I'll just give you one final reminder as well that we got the $100,000 giveaway. So, uh, you know, remember to subscribe to the challenge, subscribe to the channel, subscribe to the channel and uh, follow us along with this. We'll be giving away this $100,000 uh, from our trading profits. So, yeah, I suppose uh, thank you ever so much for watching this video. I hope it's been helpful. Remember the levels that I've given you. I mean, they're just absolutely key levels of respect right now. It's, it's very, 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 very enjoyable trading. And, um, yeah, 
hope that you've enjoyed. Thank you ever so much. And I will catch you in the next segment and the next video that we make. Cheers, everybody. Have a brilliant week ahead. Let's crush it. Thank you. And CC Pool, send their regards. Have a brilliant day. Goodbye.